Tales of Tenorio leaked a lot of things as of recently and it's cool to get to see these things in the game but welcome in today's video guys. Today we're gonna talk about the recently leaked, leaked things that Tales of Tenorio decided to do. First up they showed us how a shiny looks like in battle which is amazing because it got the rainbow text and the shiny logo and it's clear to see it whenever you find it and it's also a cool looking encounter scene and also I've heard it's like Pokemon where it's overworld shinies and it's client sided which means that only on your screen and you can see the shinies your shinies that you can get any but anyways besides that leak there's multiple other leaks that Tales of Tenorio has shown us recently and out of those I'm gonna pick one one of them which is the chain system of the game which actually it's pretty cool because there's not just one chain for every type of Tenorian there's a chaining system for wild Tenorians that you can find in the grass and fish Tenorians which I think it's a this is a big dub although the chaining system was cool I think I have a problem with it and my problem is this if you encounter a rare Tenorian no matter what your chain system resets I might misunderstand this but I think that shouldn't be a thing because I don't think everyone will want any sort of rare shiny Tenorian. Maybe someone wants that shiny t pirate bird that Lucky made a while ago and they failed their chain by finding a random shiny dolphin. Also here's a likely way of grinding up chain which is to find the Tenorian you're looking for. But there's many other leaks Tales of Tenorio has showed us but today I just wanted to talk about shiny hunting and chaining in Tales of Tenorio. Because I'm really high for the game's release and hope it comes out faster than expected. And yeah, that's it for today's video. Thanks for watching. I'm Cleon and make sure to like and subscribe. Peace out.